do you? It's it's got a little stretch at the top because this is a woman's shirt from Goodwill. I know it's got these. These are called darts, and then you put them there so you got room for your. <laughs> Hello, everybody. Welcome to the Bob Ross Challenge. Sarah is laughing because apparently we bought a girl's shirt for me at Goodwill. I was tipped off to this because uh, the buttons are on the opposite side. So today we are doing the Bob Ross Challenge. Now, Bob Ross, if you don't know who he is, I'm not going to explain it. Um, Just look it up. Look it up. And you'll bring a lot of good thoughts to your heart. Let's build a happy little cloud. Let's build some happy little trees. There are no limits here. This man always invited people to paint along with him, but have you ever known anybody? Have you ever painted along with Bob Ross? Have you no. ever? No. Today, that is exactly what we're gonna do. We're gonna learn how to paint with Bob Ross. And, and we're gonna see if our paintings come even close. Yeah, we're gonna see how our paintings turn out, okay? And then we're gonna have you guys decide in the comment section who you think is better, all right? so. Let's, let's get started. The one rule, I will remind you, we cannot pause the Bob Ross episode. We have to go as fast as he does, and so that's gonna be- We are be, Bob Ross today. Yeah, that's gonna be very, very stressful. Also, to keep us going, because painting is very tough, we're gonna be doing this for a solid 30 minutes straight, nonstop. We have our favorite organic energy drink. You guessed it, for purpose energy. Amazing. All right, so let's start this thing now. Uh, keep in mind, we don't have the exact colors that Bob Ross does. Couldn't find them. We, we you know, uh, it's close. It's very close. So here we go in three, two, one. Start off today with a little bit of phthalo blue. You putting it on the whole brush? Two inch brush. And let's go up here. And just using our little crisscross strokes, let's just drop in a happy little sky. Just start at the top and work all the way down. Oh no, it's way too black. The color is mixing with the liquid white continually and automatically. Automatically. Our brushes are such high quality, they're like coming off as we're... How did this brush do that? Also, we cannot see each other's paintings, okay? That's, that's the other thing. Start at the bottom and work upward. Your darker color then will be down here on the base. I'm sorry, I'm trying to fix up my... What kind of blue did he use with that? I don't remember. He's already on the mountain? Yeah. How do you use this stupid tool? He says that we need the white, the white paint to be super thick, but this is not thick. No, it's not thick. Our, our, we it's got, not we got thick. some paint that was uh, not very painty, and we got some brushes that the bristles fly off every five seconds. My mountain is just solid black. Did he is put he brown has, in that? I don't think it matters though. Bob Ross says you can't make any mistakes. He hadn't seen mine. I'm not even close to where he's at. I gotta hurry up. So like this. You know what? This is actually turning out oh, better than I thought. He said follow the angles of the mountain like five minutes I ago. I think you have to like make your own angles. Oh gosh. I think I can paint better as a child, honestly. What am I supposed to do with the other side of the thing? What's he using with it? The palette knife. Oh, I hate the palette knife. I like it. I can't it's get really enough nice. on it. The brown is the only nice paint. We how does it? How does this work? Like, how does the palette knife work? Did you take the good palette knife or something? They're both the same. Well, how are you getting it on there? You just do. Like, how do you get it on there when it's like this? Like, what? You use the back of it. <laughs> Jordan, use the back. How could you do this to me? This is really globby, but that'll be fine. What's he, what's he doing? A big brown tree? I can do that, I can do that. Big giant tree. Where, where he's just pounding it. He's like, always do it with Distinction, like, don't you know? You you're doing it with the shape of the tree. I don't know what the shape of this tree is. You gotta create the shape of the tree. Okay, I'm creating a shape of a something. I don't have enough paint. I haven't even used this orange, and we bought it. I'm using it. Use it. 
it. There's some red in there. He told us to buy red and haven't even used the red. Thanks, Bob. We're almost done. I think the only thing that's gonna save me is the abstractness. We're going from Monroe. What's his name? James Madison? What's that? Uh, no. You mean like Monet? Monet. <laughs> We're going with Monet. That's a little green one. And as many as you want, but work in layers. Remember that these bushes are individuals. Oh, this looks kind of good. I swear, if, if yours like actually turns out to be incredible, I'm actually gonna be mad. It's not incredible. Oh, he's done. He got no. this. I gotta put the finishing, I gotta fix this. I, my mountain isn't done. Uh, okay, we can go until the credits. Okay. One second, one second, done. But we can keep going. No, well, you're done once the, once the video ends and it's over. Wait, there's like this big green blob on It's done. We're done, okay. it's over. All right guys, we just finished finished the video. The rules are you have to stop as soon as the video stopped, even if you're not done, okay? So I think I done. did a good job I'm with mine. Um, so we're about to show you what our paintings look like. We want you guys in the comment section below, tell us who do you think did a better job? All right, here we go. Drum roll, please. Whoa! Yeah guys, look, I was, I was painting a picture of four purpose energy this entire time. I'm just kidding, Sarah actually um, painted this, but look, this is the only reason why I made it through this challenge. 30 minutes, non-stop painting, with no arts and crafts lessons, well, painting lessons as a child. It's tough. It was tough, and this is the reason why I'm going to win. If you want to win too, go to fourpurposeenergy.com, use the code Jordan to get 5% off of the massive 24 pack, okay? And also use the subscribe and save feature, which ships one of these every single month to your house for an additional 5% off. That's 10% off, guys. And not only does this drink taste amazing, raspberry pomegranate, it also is for a good cause as well. 10 cents of each can you buy is donated to build a school for kids who really need it. Not to mention it's organic, so I mean, come on, that's really cool. And if you're in college, finals are coming up, yes. so you're gonna need it. I wish to God that I had this when I was in college, but I didn't. And now for the big reveal, actual, actual reveal this time. Drum roll, please. All right, let's... Let's check yours out. Let's see this. Let me, let me see this. Wow, look at that. You got the nice reds in there and the mountain. I'm liking this depth of field. My clouds look like a dinosaur. There's the- uh, What are you talking about? There's the mountain. This is driving me Oh, nuts. I see what you're saying. Yeah, it does. And then this over here looks like a giant blob. Sarah, dang it. That looks I'll amazing. I'll probably fix this later. Now let's check mine out. Ready? <laughs> I like it. I like your sky and I really like your trees. Look, look at all That's a tree. Right what are you here. talking about? Do you like that? I like these trees and I like these trees. I like your sky. That's and nice. The mountain looks pretty cool too. No, it doesn't. The mountain is like the worst part <laughs> of the painting. There is some painting. questionable stuff down here. I was trying to figure out how to use this thing. Well, at least I didn't I know use... anyways. Want to hear from you guys. Whose painting do you think is better? Um, mine. Or Sarah's, I know it's it's gonna be a really it's gonna be a really hard call. I think there um, are some really great things in both paintings, so A, B, or C. <laughs> you guys say which one you think is the best. Alright? Let us know. We'll see you guys next next time. This is what painting with Bob Ross really looks like. <laughs> <laughs> let's, let's throw these up on eBay for the people now.